Hey guys, Bad Infos here and welcome guys to the end of 2018, what a fantastic year! If you don't know this, if you're new, I guess if you're new then welcome, welcome to my channel, I hope you have a good stay here. If you're new, you don't know this, but at the end of each year or the beginning of each new year, depending on how you look at it, I make a special video in which I discuss a lot of things. I show you some statistics, I talk about my channel, I show my goals for the previous year, if I accomplish the goals I set for myself the previous year, I show the new goals for the next year as well, and I also make a highlights of the previous year. I basically show you every video which I liked the most in the previous year of each month. So, what is there to talk about? <laughs> now, every single video I say, oh, it's gonna be short, it's gonna be like... 15-20 minutes long, but it turns out it, it's half an hour or 25 minutes, so I'm gonna try to speed this as quick as possible, you don't wanna see me blabble about random stuff about uh, half an hour, right? So let's begin. So what uh, happened in 2018? Lots of good stuff for me, because I got a very good job, a steady job, which uh, is a full-time job. Now this is bad for you too, because I spent a lot less time on my videos. That. Uh, in terms showed that uh, this year was not the, the best year so far uh, on my channel. So, what happened? I got a new job, I spent uh, 9.5 to 10 hours each day on that new job, except on Saturdays and Sundays. So that means that I have way less time to make videos, which is kind of unfortunate for you guys, but for me it is great because I have lots, a lot more money and a steady job which I like, uh, kind of like and kind of not like, but anyway, for the first time ever, I'm gonna say that this was not the best year on my channel so far. Now each year, in each of these uh, recap videos, I say this was the best year. The next video I say this was the best year, and the next one I say again this is the best year. Well this time I'm not gonna say that. Part of it was because I got a new full time job, and part of it was because I guess you guys are not that interested anymore in the type of videos I got, I make, and also I did not get any viral videos this year. The previous year and the previous year before that I got a few viral videos which got millions of views. These videos are still at a million and a half I think, or a million and six hundred thousand is the most viewed video on my channel currently, but I didn't get any viral videos this year which in turn made it not that great for me. The views the new views I should say I got this year were less than the previous year, the new subscribers are less, the number of videos I made was less, that's because of the new job, and uh, basically everything is less, but that's okay guys, I don't mind, I don't do these videos for the numbers of views or the numbers of subscribers, I just like doing what I do, so I did it. Anyway guys, should we start with the actual statistics, I'm trying to speed this as quick as possible, but this was pre pretty much the recap of the previous year. So let's start with the statistics, I have my laptop right here. Now this year I'm recording this video 15, 16 actually days before I'm gonna upload it. So these numbers I'm, sh I'm telling you guys are not correct. The actual numbers are on this side. So let's begin. The views, let's start with the views. This year I got 5,279,000. Now pulling in this amount of views while going to work every single day for 10 hours is ludicrous, not many people can say that they can do both these things. So I'm really happy with this number, even though it's a lot less than the previous year as you can see. The previous year was insane! This year was also that awesome. I'm currently at 9, 18 million, uh, almost 19 million views, which is a crazy still, a crazy number. And in the previous year I got... Um, Actually, I can't see the number here, but you can see it here, which was a lot more. But that's okay guys, I'm really happy with the number of views. Next is the number of videos. I made 199 videos, I'm recording this again 15-16 days before I'm gonna upload it. So the this is kind of a prediction because I, I haven't uploaded many of these yet. So 199 videos this year, which is a lot less than the previous year, why is that? Well. This, the previous year I had a GTA 4 walkthrough, that walkthrough took 100 episodes, which was quite about a lot. This year I got, I made two walkthroughs. Each one of these got, uh, had like 30, 35 videos, 
in each so this it says a lot less than the previous year so i didn't have a huge series which went on for 100 episodes i had uh, two shorter uh, series and a few other short series this year so that's why i have way less views uh, videos anyway these subscribers now, now let's see it's time for the subscribes i got 13 thousand and two hundred and seventy nine however this year i hit the fifty thousand subscriber mark which is a huge milestone fifty thousand can you guys imagine fifty thousand people it's a whole stadium it's a more than a stadium of course not all of these are active i get like uh, let's say two thousand three hundred three thousand active people out of these 50,000 but still the number itself is ludicrous I have 53,100 subscribers currently which is crazy I still get like maybe 1,000 uh, a month which is quite good quite good so overall I'm really happy with this year even though it was not as good as the previous year I'm really happy with how it turned out I like my quality of the content is pretty much the same as the previous year I was really happy with the, the content the quality from the previous year I'm really happy with how it turned out my channel it's currently more of a GTA channel even though I don't like considering it as a GTA channel mainly but it's, um, I mainly make GTA videos and welcome to the second part of the video in which I'm gonna discuss did I accomplish the goals I set for myself the previous year so in the previous vlog I said that I accomplished every single goal I set for myself from the previous vlog the year before that did the same thing happen did I accomplish every single thing I said in the previous vlog we shall see so the first goal I set for myself for 2018 was to start a GTA 100% walkthrough on GTA 5 or start two walkthroughs on the episodes on Liberty City because you guys could vote uh, on the next walkthrough back then and you guys chose the episodes from Liberty City and did I accomplish that? Yes, I did start a GTA um, The Battle of Gate Tony and the Battle of um, The Battle of Gate Tony and the Lost and Damned. I started these two walkthroughs and I did accomplish I completed these two walkthroughs. It was an accomplished goal I'm really happy with how they turned out. Lots of people watched them. Lots of people enjoyed them and You guys can vote on the next walkthrough currently in the last episode of the GT, the Battle of Gate Tony walkthrough video, the episode 35, I think it is. Departure time is caught that episode. So yes, I did accomplish this go amazing. Next is top uh, top X videos. This year was the year of top five games videos. I started a brand new series. It was such a long time coming. In 2014, I started categorizing my games. I wrote down every single game I have ever played in my life starting from 2000, uh, 1998 so for four years I have prepared this series and finally in at the end of March I said screw it I'm starting this series right now in April I'm, at the beginning of April I'm starting the series and by the end of 2018 I'm gonna finish it as well I'm gonna start with 1998 the year 1998 and i'm gonna finish with the year 2017 did i accomplish that yes guys i started this series and i actually finished this series by the end of this year i'm really happy with how the production quality of this particular series went it was amazing lots of people enjoyed it lots of people hated me because i didn't choose their favorite game because they're stupid and this is just an opinion you don't understand that this is just an opinion of me but anyway, I'm really happy with the top 5 videos and also the top 10 cutscene videos I did as well. In the future, of course, I'm gonna make more of these from a bi-weekly series. It's gonna turn into a yearly series because I'm out of years to make videos on. <laughs> anyway, this is an accomplished goal. Next is 10 things you didn't know about GTA Vice series stories and GTA San Andreas. In 2017... I think yeah 2017 I started to work on the 10 more things you didn't know about San Andreas and finally at the end of 2018 I uploaded that video 
As for GTA Vice City stories, sorry I did not accomplish this goal, but it was <laughs> now this goal is semi completed, semi not completed, because I said I was gonna start uh, do a GTA more things you didn't know about San Andreas and uh, things you didn't know about Vice City stories. So, kind of accomplished, kind of not accomplished this goal. Okay, it's pretty good. Then, the next goal is 5 real live videos. 5 videos in which you can see my face. I uploaded 8 whole videos of myself. The first one is the Audio Technica headphones review, which was very, very badly received. Lots of negative comments from people who don't understand opinions. <laughs> but anyway, that was a pretty badly received, lots of hate, lots of dislikes, it's okay. The next one is the Sennheiser headphones review, which uh, got a very good uh, reception, lots of people liked it. Then the one year later PC uh, build video, in which I showed you uh, what uh, my thoughts one year after using my newly acquired PC, which I built in 2017, in August. So that was the third video so far. Then I had the SSD guide. How to install an NVMe M.2 SSD, which I uploaded in December. And then I have the laptop guide, which also I uploaded in December. So these were SSD guides primarily. Then I had the OHKO episode 9, in which I added a webcam to the video, which does that count as towards this number? Even if it doesn't, it's still 5 videos so far. So this is the 6th video, then we have the 7th walk GTA walkthrough trailer, in which I of course showed my face as well, and then I have the, uh, the 50,000 subscribers special, which is a very special video, obviously 50,000 subscribers is it's crazy. So yes, 8 videos, 5 of which are were exclusive no gameplay videos, in which I just show my face. So yes, this goal is completed, next is one live stream. I said I'm gonna make a live stream this year, I kinda did because YouTube introduced a feature in which um, it's called Premieres, in which I upload a video and I'm showing you guys live the video and I'm talking in the chat with you guys, I'm, I'm chatting with you guys, I'm not talking, I'm just chatting with you guys, which is kind of like a live stream but kind of not, so this is kind of completed, kind of not, but I mainly would consider this not completed. So no, I did not accomplish this goal. In the future, lots of people want me to live stream. So yes, I'm gonna live stream in the future. I'm gonna try it out. I just didn't have the time to devote into learning OBS and uh, all that crap with live streaming. Anyway, next this NFH Hardcore start uh, neighbors from hell Hardcore walkthrough. Yes, guys, I just started. This was <laughs> this took me a whole year to start to complete to prepare. And yes, I did start and I did complete it. And next, I said I was gonna start a walkthrough of a new Neighbors from Hell game which I have never seen before. That turned out to be Neighbors from Hell Portal. And yes, guys, I did complete that mod as well. A full-blown walkthrough which was 3 episodes long. It was, again, well-received, re well so I'm happy with that one. But yes, I did complete this go. Amazing. Next one is a new Let's Play. And I hinted at Stardew Valley that was gonna be the let's play. So I said I was gonna start a let's play and make it alongside other content I do. I said I was gonna start a let's play and as I upload other content I'm gonna continue uploading this let's play. It kinda didn't happen, kinda did happen. I was hinting at Stardew Valley or Don't Starve. I did not do that. Because lots of people are not interested in Let's Plays and I consider Let's Plays as low effort content. I don't want to do that. It, it's not fulfilling to me to upload these videos because they're, they're low effort. People still are gonna watch them but low effort is not my thing anymore. Back in the day in 2012 I did put out low effort content. Now it's not the same. So I did not accomplish this goal. Apologies for that. I may still do it, I, I kinda actually did it because I did start an OHKO mod playthrough of uh, GTA San Andreas, which is kind of a let's play, kind of not, so again, kind of complete, kind of not, but mainly it's not complete. Next, is make a channel trailer, which again, kind of complete, kind of not, because I did not make a specific trailer 
a proper trailer for my channel, but I changed the trailer video on my channel. It was not specifically made for it, but I did change it, so kinda complete, kinda not, but again, I don't consider this as a completed goal. So yeah, overall I did complete the majority of the stuff, but I did not complete some. So yes, I'm happy with how it turned out, yes, I'm happy with this year. Now for the goals of the, tour the next year, which is 2019, what do I, what are my goals for the next year? The first one is to start a new walkthrough, guys. So at the end of the GTA, the Battle of Gate Tony walkthrough, I said, you guys can vote on the next walkthrough. It could be on GTA 5, it could be on GTA Chantown Wars, it could be on Sleeping Dogs, it could be on Watch Dogs 2, or it could be on Saints Row 2. You guys decide what the next walkthrough is gonna be. My goal is to start that walkthrough. I'm not gonna finish it, I guarantee I'm not gonna finish it, but before the end of 2019 I promise to start it at least. And if I start it, it's gonna be at the end of 2019, I guarantee that, because I have lots of other series I wanna do and I wanna break from walkthrough videos because they... And these video, these games actually are gonna take a lot more time of preparation, especially when I start if I'm gonna start GTA 5, because that game is enormous, the preparations for that game is it's ludicrous. So yes, start either GTA 5, GTA Chanta Wars, Watch Dogs 2, Sleeping Dogs, or Saints Row 2. Start one of these walkthroughs. Next is top 10 videos, basically top X videos. I'm gonna continue the top games, but they're gonna be different. For instance, I'm gonna do top 5 RPG games of all time, top 5 FPS games of all time, top 5 games ever released on the PC of all time. Yes, I'm gonna continue this trend of top X videos, it could be top 10 videos, could be top 5 videos on games, on characters, on cutscenes, on basically anything, top X on something. Next, this again, I'm gonna set this goal for myself, I'm really, really interested in this feature. In live streaming, I do want to live stream, guys. At least one live stream in 2019. I did not complete this goal in 2018. I want to do it for next year, guys. I do want to do it. I just don't have the time to devote into learning stuff. Okay, next is five real live videos. Again, a goal from the previous year. I like showing my face, guys. And every time I upload a video of my face, people say, "Oh, um." Face review, face review, bad infos, ha, you look good, you look awesome, you look sexy. Yes, I do, I, I agree, but <laughs> you guys say that every single time, even though my face has never been a secret from 2012, it has never been a secret. But yeah, at least five real life videos, I do want to do that, it's very fun showing my face and talking to you guys with my mouth and you can see my mouth move and spit coming out of my mouth sometimes. Anyway, next is, um, oh yeah, GTA checklist, 100% checklist. So, in 2018, the idea of checklist videos was born. I uploaded lots of checklist, uh, lots, four, four, only four checklist videos on GTA 3, Vice Series, Andreas, Liberty City Stories, and I ended there. I want to continue this. This is uh, very high effort, this is my most... Uh, most high effort uh, series of my channel because it takes a lot of time, a lot of editing, a lot of recording and whatnot. So I want to do one on Vice City Stories, one on GTA 4, on The Lost and Damned and The Battle of Gay Tony. Why not on Chantown Wars and GTA 5? Because I want to finish the walkthroughs and then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do these checklist videos. So after I finish a walkthrough, I like uh, doing a checklist video because it, I talk about my walkthrough in those videos. So if I don't have a walkthrough to talk about, I cannot make that video. So yes, checklist on these games are gonna be made in this year. And it's pretty much it for all the goals. I'm gonna set a few less goals than previous year. And guys, it's time for many the best part of these recap videos. It is the highlights of the previous year. Basically, I'm gonna show you the, my favorite videos of each month of the previous year, 2018. As I said, this year, was, this year was not as video heavy as the previous one, that was because of the lack of the huge series which was the GTA 4 walkthrough, which means that I have less videos this year, and in turn less videos each month. However, the production quality is still the same, and in each month I have amazing videos to showcase to you guys, so 
I hope you watch every single one of these which I mentioned. Let's begin with January. In January I had 14 whole videos, which is way less than the previous year, but still 14 videos in which, from which, and my favorite one was the GTA 3 100% checklist video. This was the start of the checklist videos, the highest predicted, the highest production quality videos this year, along with the top 5 videos, uh, games videos, which was also very high quality, but this video started it all. The production quality, lots of people loved the production quality in this one, lots of information was given to you guys in that video, and I'm happy with how it turned out. Next, in February I had 12 videos only, which was a lot, but uh, 2 less videos. And my favorite one that month was the 7th GTA 5 uh, GTA 100% <laughs> walkthrough. It was on GTA the, the Lost and Damned. In that game there's bikers and I showed myself as a biker in that video. You should watch it because it's very short and I show myself as a biker so I looked hardcore and like muscular and um, hardcore basically. Yeah, you should watch that, it's pretty short. Next, in March I had 18 videos, which was a lot more videos, 18 whole videos. My favorite one was Minecraft Speed Challenge Player Record version 2. Many years ago, I think 3-2 years ago I made a speed challenge of Minecraft, in which I uh, basically did a challenge to play a record, start the game from the start and get a record and play it in a jukebox. This year I decided to redo the challenge and it turned out great, it's a long video so you may not watch it and guys, shut your face, I still like Minecraft, the Minecraft haters in my comments are infuriating, if I like something I'm gonna do it, there is a creeper on my, on my monitor, which I look at every single day, I still love this game, shut your face! <laughs> ah, anyway, this is a great video in my opinion. Many people are not gonna like it, which is understandable, not everyone likes Minecraft. But anyway, this was that for the year of March. Next is April, I have 23 videos, the most active month for me. And the best one was the 5 best games of 1998, the beginning of the top 5 games videos. As I said, in March I said, screw it, I'm starring this series, like it or not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sleep in front of my computer, but I'm gonna start it. and finish it by the end of this year. And yes guys, I did start and it was so well received, lots of people liked it, lots of people hated me because of my opinions which differ from theirs, which is stupid in my opinion. May in 2017 was pretty bad, but in 2018 it was great, I had 17 whole videos and the best video of that was the GTA 3 Ultimate Hidden Package Location Guide plus Markers. That again is the beginning of the location guides videos which are highly produced guides on how to find all the packages. I did one for GTA 3, for Vice City and for GTA 3 the tags, the horseshoes, the oysters and snapshots, <laughs> yeah, that too. So I made all of these videos and this was the beginning of it. In May I started, uh, I made this GTA 3 location guide video, which was pretty long, but if you have trouble finding collectibles then watch this, this series, it was great. Next, in June, I had 15 videos and I uploaded the GTA San Andreas OHKO Summer Mode Live Webcam videos. Yes, guys, you heard me right, I had a webcam on the video itself. I never do this. And out of all the videos this year I uploaded, this was my favorite video, it's, which is kind of uh, surprising because it's a low effort video. Because I just show my face, I just put my face in the webcam and then just talk about the game. I just play the game and talk about it live. Which is kind of surprising because I spent like uh, uh, two weeks on some videos, three weeks on some videos, like the checklist videos, like the top five games videos. I also spent lots of time there. But this is my favorite one. It's because I think my commentary was amazing in there. My Facial expressions were amazing, it's something new I have never done on my channel before, so it was new, exciting, lots of good reception was received from, from this video, so you guys liked it, I liked it too, so yes, it's my favorite videos this year, not the highest produced video, the highest quality video, but it was great, I really appreciate the feedback on this one. Next, in uh, July, 
Neighbors from Hell Power 2 Season 3 100% walkthrough. In the previous month in June I started the walkthrough of uh, Neighbors from Hell Power 2 and this was the last episode. The last episode is insane. It is very difficult guys. Almost as hard as Neighbors from Hell Hardcore. Which is another mod for Neighbors from Hell. So yes, I did start this. I actually finished it in this month, so you should watch this video, it was, the commentary was good in it and the game itself is great too. Next, in August. August was the least heavy month this year, because I had only 11 videos, when have I done that? Only 11 videos! Well, I started a new job of a couple months before that, so I did not have much time to record and also it was in between two major series, the OHK Summer Mod uh, playthrough of GTS San Andreas and also I was preparing for it, the Battle of Gate Tony walkthrough, so I did not have much time to record, I started the job and I didn't have much time because of the job and because of the preparations of the walkthrough and after finishing playthrough I had no prepared, pre-prepared -pre videos to record, so yes, my favorite one this month was the PC build uh, Ryzen 7 GTX uh, 1080 PC build one year later, the one year, year later video on my PC. Yeah, I showed my face of course, I showed my PC, I talked about my PC, I talked about the issues I had with the PC, I showed you what I liked and what I disliked about it one year later after using it. In September, I hit 50,000 subscribers, 50,000 of you came to my channel to click the button which said subscribe. And I'm really happy with <laughs> you guys for that. I uploaded uh, 18 videos, but this video was very special for me, very, very special and very short as well. I showed my face again in that video and I showed you some, some happenings from the previous years some highlights I guess as well. In October I had 19 videos and of course, of course I would put the CJ and Big Smoke love song, of course I would, I have two song videos on my channel. This is the second one and I liked it I so much, just one Sunday I said I'm just gonna sit on my PC and just play games and as I'm playing I said Oh, I want to I wanna make a big smoke video guys, I want to make a big smoke video, I was hinkering to just start a big smoke video, so I said, huh, what could be a good interesting video? CJ can sing, big smoke can sing, they have nice dialogue, so maybe why, won't, why don't they just fall in love with each other and spend, uh, sing about that? So yes, I did do a CJ love song, it was a very stupid video not very highly produced, but I spent a whole Sunday making this video, a whole Sunday dedicated to this video, like 8 hours it took probably, and the production quality is not great, the animations are pretty bad, but still I liked it a lot. In November I had 19 videos and of course the best one is the 10 more things you didn't know about San Andreas. The 10 things you didn't know about uh, games, uh, videos, are my most viewed video, my highest received videos, my most liked and disliked videos as well on my channel and of course I would put this one as well because it also got well well received, lots of views I got as well from that video and it took me like a whole year to, to start and finish, it was <laughs> crazy how much time and effort it took to make this video and I appreciate the feedback on it, so thank you so much. And lastly, for December, I have the GTA Chinatown Wars Mayhem Challenge. Yes, guys, my first official video on Chinatown Wars, my commentary was top notch in that video. I loved my commentary in that. I had an energy drink before I started recording, so my voice was kind of high pitched and I was very happy, like how I'm currently right now. <laughs> and I liked that, and the challenge itself was great too. So yeah, you should watch that, it's uh, my first official video on Chinatown Wars, in the future I'm gonna start a uh, walkthrough on that game. And guys, this was pretty much it for this recap video, I hope you enjoyed it. And again, like I said, I started and said it was gonna be, take me like 15 minutes, of course, of course, and now it, it turned out to be very uh, long as well, but guys, seriously, thank you so much for being here, thank you very much for commenting, for subscribing, for watching my videos, for engaging in the content, for giving me suggestions and whatnot. Thank you to all the people who follow me on Twitter as well. Thank you to every single person who engages in my content in some way. 
I really appreciate every single thing you have done for me this year. Even though it was not the best year so far on my channel, it was still on a fantastic year, guys. A lot less views, a lot less subscribers, a lot less videos as well, but everything else is great. The adpocalypse is a lot better this year, which means that I get more money from my videos, which was pretty much non-existent, the money was not pretty much non-existent the previous year, but yeah, it's a lot better, you guys engage in my content a lot more, so thank you guys so much. However, with that said, I have a very important announcement. This will be the last year in which I answered all my comments. You saw this coming, guys. It was inevitable. And it's not because, oh, I have 50,000 subscribers. I don't care about you guys. Yes, I'm, I'm too big for answering all my comments. No, guys. I still want to engage with every single person. I still want to answer my comments. It all comes down to this. I don't have the time to devote into this activity. I get like, it depends, about 1000 comments a month. That means that I have to spend at least an hour, at least an hour every single day to answer these comments. I would rather spend this one hour on something which more people are gonna enjoy, like making videos, editing videos, something else, getting out with friends or whatnot. I don't wanna spend that much time answering comments to people who are not even gonna read my comments my replies many people don't reply back which means that it's uh, it's effort on my part for nothing so yeah it's gonna be last year i'm still gonna read every single comment but not answer all the comments for seven years i have done this i have answered every single comment ex except of course the ones which are in other languages or the most hateful comments there's no point in engaging in hateful comments and I can't understand some comments, so yeah, this is it guys, pretty much the end of me replying to every single comment, I apologize for that, it's because of the time issue and because some comments infuriate the heck out of me, especially on the top 5 videos because some people don't grasp the idea of an opinion, so yeah, this was the end, thank you so much for commenting and you can still comment, I still read every single thing, but I'm not gonna answer everything. guys. With that said, this is a fantastic year, even though I got way less statistics, way less views, uh, videos and subscribers, this was a fantastic year, thank you again so much for engaging in my content and I hope I have a good night next year on my channel and I hope you guys as well have a fantastic year in 2019. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in the next video.